everyone, this is Dave from Geekanoids and this is my unboxing and review of the iAmiga Mac Companion hard drive. This is a 7200 RPM, 2 terabyte hard drive and you notice a little sort of bit of writing here on the packaging. This is one of the unique features of this, it's got an iPad port. And if I turn this round to show you the back of the box you will see a little diagram of the connections which I'll run over when I actually unbox the product for you but you also see a picture here of an iPad connected to the hard drive what it actually allows you to do is actually charge and synchronize your iOS device through the port on the Mac companion hard drive so let's get this unboxed and show you what you get inside we have got the drive itself which I'll show you in a minute we've also got a instruction manual, quick start guide, and this is going to get you up and running nice and quickly. We have also got a box with some cables in. So let's show you those cables. Here we go. So we've got a multi voltage power adapter, three pin UK uh, sort of adapter connector on here as well. Nothing else under there. We've also got a Firewire 800 cable. So this is a nice fast connection. We've also got USB connector. We've also got a Firewire 800 to Firewire 400 connector as well. And a little bit of paperwork in there, some promotional material. So let's pop that to one side and we'll show you the drive itself. So here we go, this is the Mac Companion hard drive. Very nicely packaged. and we're straight into it, very glossy on the top as you can see we've got the iAmiga logo on the top here on the front we've got some activity LED going on there and then round on the side we've got a Kensington lock so we can actually tether this to a desk this is the iPad port so this is where you can plug in your synchronization cable, your 30 pin dock connector cable to synchronize and charge your iOS device by plugging in here Round on this side, completely blank, and then round on the back is where all the connections happen, and we've got a plethora of ports. We've got the input for the power cable, we've got that USB connection, and that's what's going to connect this to your, um, to your computer. Two additional USB sockets here, and we've also got two Firewire connections. So we can connect, obviously, via Firewire for those faster data transfer speeds. Round on the bottom, we've got a rubberized base, and then I should point out that this is actually brushed aluminium, so very, very solid construction. The only thing I don't like with this one, and it does get me a little bit annoyed, but I suppose it looks really nice if you keep it clean. But this is a real fingerprint magnet, which is a shame. Performance-wise, 7200 RPM, 2 terabyte hard drive in this one. You can get different capacities. Very good data transfer speed especially if you're connected via that Firewire 800 connector. I also really do like the addition of this port on the side. I think that is a fantastic idea. The fact that you lose a port by connecting a hard drive, it's really nice that iAmiga have thought of adding that through port so that you can still connect your iOS device. I think that's a really nice touch. So this is the iAmiga Mac Companion. This particular one, two terabytes of capacity. £240 in the UK, so not cheap when it comes to hard drive standards, you can get a lot cheaper but you're getting a really nice robust and well built hard drive here. £240 in the UK equates to around about $290 in the US, which might sound strange because it doesn't really does it? £240 should be about $360 in the US, so the US get a much better buy with this particular iAmiga hard drive. Shop around and you might find it slightly cheaper. So thanks very much for watching. This has been Dave from Geekanoids. Please do hit that like button and I will see you all in the next video.